Chapter 5, The Last Reel. I knew that song. Everyone knows that song. Who are you? Why are you here? I was invited by an old friend. And now I can't leave. Then you know more than we do. One minute, we don't even exist. Just... thoughts. And the next minute, this place. Are you gonna let me out of here? Down here, strangers aren't good things. How can we trust you? We don't even know what you are. My name is Henry. I used to work here. I... I honestly don't know my name. So, they call me Alice. But I'm no angel. You go back and rest. We'll talk again later. It's only for a few hours, no need to worry. I won't go far. Only up to level six. Just stay here. Keep an eye on Henry, okay? I'll be back as soon as I can. I promise. Henry? Here, you must be hungry. Sorry, it's all we have. I know you're watching me. It's just... a little creepy. You're the one that writes on the walls. We all do. For some poor souls down here, it's the only way they can be heard. But you don't want to touch the ink for too long. It can claim you. Pull you back. That's how I met Tom. I was messing with things I shouldn't have been, and he... He was there. Why do you call him Tom? He just seems to respond to it. Well, I don't think he's very fond of me. Let me show you something. A while back, I was mapping out one of the upper levels, when I noticed something reflecting off a piece of glass. I held up the glass, looked through, and on the wall behind me was a hidden message. Right there, in plain sight. So, I kept looking, and found more and more messages everywhere in the studio. But you can't see them with your eyes. Only through this. Take a look. I don't know who's leaving them. But I think they know how to get out of here. Where does it all lead to? Nowhere. I followed them for a long time. Just leads me in circles. I don't think I meant to leave this place, Henry. But maybe... You are. Alice, please let me out of here. Tom thinks you're dangerous. And what do you think? I... I think... You're the hope I've been waiting for. Go to sleep. Maybe tomorrow will be better. Really stupid, Tom. You shouldn't have gone out there. Now that he's seen you, it's only a matter of time before he finds us here. Not with the ink, D. 
Steven right outside the door. What's going on? He's coming. We have to move on. Tom, we have to let him out. Butthead! Escape your prison. Hi, I'm Max. Welcome back to Benny and the English Machine. This is chapter 5. So, I, I the la what you just saw at the start of this video was uh, still um, in the recording session for the... Okay, I'm just going to pause it. In the recording session for the chapter 4 video. So I just had to end the recording. I'll have to do some whole hodgepodge thing in the editing, but it'll work. But yeah, um, didn't realize it was going to be so cutscene heavy. I was like, okay, I need to fix this. Okay, what do I do? They, I can't read that. Uh, can I step back? There's always hope. She will leave you... Or dead. Very subtle. Whoa. Take the spoon. Oh? Flush. Oh, sick. Oh, now the pipe can break logs. Break wood. That's dumb over here? Soup. And a wrench. I can't touch that. Wow, I'm really in a hurry. Yeah. These things are impossible to fight without getting hit. Is there even a way to... Are you supposed to get hit? You're probably supposed to get hit. Come on. Can I get an axe, please? Is it standing in the ink too long really bad? Because I won't stand in it. Wait, wait! Oh! What'd I do? No, 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 don't leave without me. Oh, it's not gonna. Okay. Um. Oh, do I just hop in it? Okay. He knows it just... Oh, pull it again? Ah, I'm just done. Okay. Take it. Alright. Perfect. Oh, I'm supposed to hold it. Yeah. I want my cereal. Pipes, nice. What was that? If I turn my head, it's brighter on the edges. Um, oh. Okay, they just stopped there. Oh! It sounds like something's stuck in the paddle wheel. <laughs> that reminds me a bit. It even has it music. What the heck? Oh, oh, oh. Turn around. I can't turn around. This is as far as I can turn. Wow, 
Wow, you can't move while you do that, okay. It was probably just me going down. This isn't too bad. Stop it, stop it, stop it. I thought it wasn't working for a second. Uh-oh. And this is where Pennywise would come out. Abyss, oh no. Oh, hey, ink guy. I made it. I'm so good at this game, I want cereal. What the? Oh, that broke. It's time to believe. Can I open this? No. Danger, keep It's like a village. Oh. Might as well just give me an axe. What's the point in this? Oh, snap! Stop! Stop! Mm, what was I supposed to do? Stop! Ha! Got it down. I believe. Okay, give it a minute. Regen. I missed! There. Put your face in my axe, really? Okay. How about you put your face in my pipe, ow? I shouldn't have done that. Oh, shoot. Oh, I broke his face. Was it that easy? Oh! You lied to me. You said I'd be free. I didn't say nothing. Well, I'm going to free you now. Free your head right off your shoulders. Sheep, sheep, sheep. It's time for sleep.
Let's go. Yay! You're lucky we were in the neighborhood. <laughs> Maybe that is Sammy. Maybe it's just the way he yelled made it sound him? different. I don't think so. The searchers and the lost ones built this place. Sammy must have been keeping them at bay. Now that he's gone. Oh. Looks like we're in for a fight. Get ready. That was Sammy. Maybe he just sounded different. You're no match for the axe. Ones that walk, ones that talk, ones that gawk. You know. Ha! My axe isn't gonna break, is it? I'm gonna die. Give me a moment. Give me a break. I don't wanna die. Help. Let me run in circles till I'm healed. Okay, I'm good. Get away from me. Oh, these guys require two hits. Oh my gosh. Keep fighting. Oh gosh. Oh my gosh. I'm just gonna they're doing all the fighting. Ah. Oh, what the? Miners? From Minecraft? Oh, these guys take forever to kill. I hate this. Stop it, please. Die! Oh my gosh! No, I shouldn't have done that. I shouldn't have done that. Yeah, at least they're not like Lego NPCs that just like sit there and pretend to fight. Oh, no. Help me. I'm going to be so hosed. Oh, my gosh. I'm going to die. Help me! Oh, that was it. Okay. Okay, I kill them while they're coming out so they don't hit me. They can't hit me if they're dead. How many are there? Oh, I'm dead, I'm dead. Oh, okay. Do they just kind of ignore me more when I'm... Higher health. Hi. Oh my gosh, this better be the last bullet wave. This is ridiculous. That one had a weapon! No! No! Okay, you guys can fight him. Uh, them. I'll fight these things. They're easy. Don't die! No! Oh my gosh. But you never know where they're gonna crawl out of next. Shadows and suffering. Probably best if we stay together from now on. Henry? Think you can lead the way? Wait, what's in here? Uh, this is where he lived? Wow. What a loser. I thought Sammy died. Oh my gosh! Best pitch, be early for your appointment. Keep pitch under three minutes. Have your pitch be check ready. Okay. Administration. There's a room right here. It's locked, okay. Film vault. Now that's interesting. 
Ah, pipe puzzles. So yeah, we're in the sewer. Welcome to Chateau Mars. Quiet. Joey Drew Studios. Although we're making progress, the client's expectations keep changing. What started as a machine to simply mold life-size figures now seems to be teetering on the edge of magic more than engineering. Although Mr. Drew remains convinced that it was the same thing, the process of running the cartoons that will do the machine for the figures to imprint upon themselves is going well. We've had several near successes. One weird note, the first figure ever created was a failed attempt in the likeness of the character called Bendy. Since that time, no other attempts at this particular figure have emerged. And the one that did, I don't know. There's just something unworldly about him. Interesting. Yes, I am listening. Hello, Boris. There has to be an achievement for getting all those boxes. Oh. Oh, so the pipes must be around somewhere here, somewhere. Um. There's probably one right here, actually. No, there isn't. Pipes, pipes, pipes. Where might he be? Ah, oh, I need to find ink. Where would I get ink? Here? Is this open? Perfect. Uh, oh, save. Always on time. Okay, uh... Film vault. Okay, what do I need? Straight down... And curve. Straight T and curve, okay. Another day, another dollar. I like his voice. It's nice. Oh. Not these guys again. I better stay out of sight. What's in here? Oh, just a hiding closet. Yeah. Cool. A small memo to all administration offices. Rumors have begun to fly that we simply can't tolerate any longer. The idea that the company is in some form of financial difficulty is untrue, and a slanderous lie against us. It's also been known to me that some backroom incompetents are not trusting in my leadership. As a leader, I'm always steering the boat, guiding our destiny, looking at the big picture. No need for you people to worry about such complicated things. Just do whatever it is you do, and trust your leader, which is me. Okay. Cool. Ah! Oh my gosh! No! You can't chase me in here! Can you just forget where I am? Can I lose you? No! Ah! Gosh dang it!
Oh my gosh. Had I just gone the other way, at the very start, if I just went right instead of left, I would have been done with this way sooner. I'm an idiot. I'm such a moron. They're gonna see me. Okay. Uh, uh, it's a new dawn, it's a new day, and it's a new life, because I died on my way getting back, getting here. Um, no, I'm not feeling good. This sucks. I, can I close this door? No. The, how did I open it in the first place? This desk is here. Uh, did I open it? I don't know if I opened it or not. Anyway, tape. Play the tape. So it turns out it's my lucky day. I got to clean in some of the offices around 2 a.m. last night. And what do you think I find in one of the chairs? A big freaking chocolate cake, just sitting there, practically yelling my name. You know, I work hard. I earn my pay every darn dollar. But you know what this company's missing? Little better fitting points. And this here cake, it's a point. Hopefully no one finds out what I've done. Because if they did, I can tell you what would happen. I'm out of here. Hmm, <laughs> okay. Um... Can I use this? No. You saw me through the window? You suck! Ah! Uh, I can't m move. Mmm. Okay, here's another one. Oh, it's got a bunch of stuff in it. Sick. Anything in here to look at? And the nice thing with this is no one's gonna walk in here. Jet. Listen, Tommy, I know you boys over at Jet are doing your best, but I'm paying for living attractions, not weird abominations. Whatever that great thing was I saw wandering around your office, you better keep it locked up tight. I realize it was a first attempt, but imagine if the press caught sight of it. Might scare off investors. And in response to your previous memo, if you claim that your failures are because these things are soulless, Hmm. Okay, there's another thing right here. Tidy. Darn it. Am I supposed to just click this thing? Jump in it? No. There's something I need to do. Dang it, now I'm reset. I don't know where anyone is. I was in here before. Joey Drew. Oh shoot! I know where a thing is. Yeah, there's a thing right there pouring stuff. But I made it here now. I know how much this part means to you, Susie. Alice means a lot to me too. Gosh, all of my characters do. In fact, I'll let you in on a little secret. I too really believe my characters are more than just drawings. They're alive. They're part of them. And I want people to know them as well as I do. I want people to be able to shake their hand, spend an afternoon with them, love them. Susie, I'll be straight with you. I'm putting together a small project, a little ceremony. If it works, a lot of dreams will come true. And I want you to be a part of it. I want you to bring Alice to life once again. What do you say? Can I close this? No. Wait, what am I supposed to do here then? Oh yeah, there's the goo thing. But, oh, there's a soup. Okay. They can't see me if I'm, like, back here, right? We'll see. Ooh, soup. Perfect. But now I have to go in there two more times. I hate this game. Alright, I don't need this. What's the difference? Okay, uh, I do need this. So, um... Now I have to go back in there, which is stupid. What the flip? I better get overtime for this.
There's the thing. I don't know how I didn't just get spotted then. I'm surprised I avoid dying. Okay, um... Now I have to do that two more times. Yay, I'm so excited. I'm just gonna cut until I get to this, because I know none of you want to watch this bullcrappery. What's the next pipe? I do need that, right? Yes, I need a twisty pipe and a tea pipe. Okay. Now I just need one more. Is there like a thing, a pump somewhere I can turn which will change which one of those things it's coming out of? That'd be awesome. Oh my gosh. Okay, tea pipe. Perfect. Spit it out. Perfect. Types are pro and problems, not our problems. Search the vault. Wait! Um. Any soup cans? Doesn't look like it. I think I'm safe, but I'm not sure. Search the vault for what? A part? Oh. Looks like whatever was here ah! was go. How did you get down here? It pays to carry a rope. You should try it. Look, I know where we have to go, but it's not going to be pleasant. The Ink Demon has something that we need. I'm going after him. You want to go to his lair? Are you crazy? That's death. That's where the trail seems to lead. <sighs> well, it's probably close by. Probably through that door. But it won't be easy to open. I'll need three gears, a crowbar, and some kind of counterbalance. Huh. Well, that works too. I guess. You follow me? Oh, now we have Tim. Lovely old Tim. Strangely familiar. This is way familiar. No, it's not. It's glasses. Quiet. Don't make any noise. What do you mean? Death? Oh, yes, please. Wow. I've never seen this before. I don't see any way around. Nothing to build a raft with. We'll have to wait across. We can't. We're not like you, Henry. If we go in there, 
Well, a drop of water in the ocean is rarely seen again. And I guess it's all up to me. And I don't even know what I'm doing here. I don't even know why this is all happening to me. You're here for a reason, Henry. There's always a reason. Even when you can't understand it. It's time. Set us free. Okay. Can I move? Enter the machine. Could have at least given me a weapon. I know, right? Can I go back and ask for one? Hey, can I have a weapon? No? Fine. You're jerks. Hello, peoples. I can still see them. Oh, not anymore. Yes, the convenient swipe of safety possible. What am I supposed to do? Woo! He's moving. Lever. This is a dead end. Whoops. Woo! Oh my gosh. Wow, this is easy. Just stick to the sides. Just look both ways before crossing the road. I swear I just saw a lever. Whoa. Lever. What exactly am I doing with all these levers? Ah, here's one. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I just opened a bunch of doors, okay. Sick. Is he going through here? 
Doesn't look like he's going through here. Oh, that was easy. Uh oh, boss area. Me no likey. Two batteries for what? Who's laughing now? I walk up to here. Yep, thought of it. Thought so. Am I supposed to do anything with these? Oh no! Oh, I need him to break the pipes. Okay. Oh snap! Please, ring around the rosies. Perfect. Perfect. Come on, buddy. Come on. Oh. Oh, he's gone. Okay. Look out. Henry, so soon. I didn't expect you for another hour yet. Now you're just trying to impress me. But I know, I know, you have questions. You always do. The only important question is this. Who are we, Henry? I thought I knew who I was, but the success starved me. Nothing left but lines on a page. In the end, we followed two different roads of our own making. You, a lovely family. Me, a crooked empire. And my road burned. I let our creations become my life. The truth is, you were always so good at pushing, old friend. Pushing me to do the right thing. You should have pushed a little harder. <sighs> Henry, come visit the old workshop. There's something I need to show you. All right, Joey, I'm here. Let's see if we can find what you wanted me to see.
Tell me another one, Uncle Joey. Jam. <laughs> that was awesome. I don't know what to say. unlocked the scene tool in all previous chapters you have unlocked the archives bonus content cool Welcome to the archives. Benny and the Ink Machine began when the developer cartoonist known as the Meatly experimented with bringing a sketched 2D style into a 3D world. After turning the idea into a horror game, chapter one of the game was created in a little under a week with programmer slash friend Mike Mood and released on February 10th in 2017, much to their surprise. It struck a chord with global indie gamers almost overnight, right, thematically, and the Meatly and Mike Mood decided to drop all other projects to work on Bendy and tell a most unique ink story. The entire game was completed a chapter at a time in a year and a half by a, remained as, by a small but dedicated group of indie developers, although the concept and story remained as originally intended. The game changed over development as characters and models were refined from their early thrown together versions. This archive is a peek behind the scenes at the process. Whoa! Huh. Concept Bendy. This is the first version of Bendy ever modeled, and in the earliest concepts, Bendy was much smaller and cuter, with a face that split open to reveal a terrifying mouth. Hm. Alpha Bendy. <laughs> this, this is the original game we used design of Ink Bendy from the earliest versions of Chapter 1. It is jokingly referred to as bird poop with a... <laughs> My brain is frying. Jigging referred to as bird poop with a smile among the development team. <laughs> Beta Bendy. This was Ink Bendy's form until the re release of Chapter 4. At that time, the game received a major visual upgrade and the title of character got a new model as well. Hmm. 
Still have the back spines? I don't know. Ink Bendy, he, as we know him today, although similar to Beta Bendy, he, this upgraded version was remodeled, enhanced with a higher polygon count, and given new ink effects. Hmm. Beast Bendy, Ink Bendy's horrific final form in Chapter 5 pulled away the cartoon facade and revealed the demon within. Sammy. Very cool. Pipers. Beta Searcher. Early in development, with just a few weeks to create Chapter 2, the Beta Searchers were designed in record time before being fully retooled later on. They were the first fetching fighting enemies encountered in the game. Strikers. Fishers. Final Searcher. The Final Searchers were far more robust in appearance. They were smoother with better ink effects and a more human appearance. Cool. Beta Sammy. What's wrong with Beta Sammy? Just not as refined. Has no feet. With his first appearance in Chapter 2, fan favorite Sammy Lawrence became a terrifyingly entertaining character. When his slim build was deemed not threatening enough, he was redesigned and given a better skeletal rig for more advanced animation. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. Final Sammy. Sammy Lawrence's final form came complete with a bulked up stature and more powerful limbs than me. That songwriter may finally get noticed now, at least by fans. Nice. Yeah, he's got feet now. Oh. Hmm. Cool. Awesome. Oh, ho, ho, ho. oh! Original torn up Boris, Beta Boris. Papa was the original name of the character that eventually became Boris the Wolf. This early version was released with Chapter One. He was quickly refined into the Boris we know today with the release of Chapter Two. I jumped. Why did I jump? Cool. Boris the Wolf. Boris the Wolf, a friend to the end, was designed using various references from the cartoons of the nine. 1920s, a blend of West Coast and East Coast animation styles, the silent and supportive wolf won over the hearts of many, although at times he was a headache for the development team due to his AI taking on a mind of its own during production. <laughs> oh, Brute Boris. Alice Angel's monstrosity, the Brute Boris, was one of the biggest surprises of Chapter 4. His design was roughly based on the Frankenstein monster, but with a more ref unfinished appearance, Alice took parts from within him and substituted things that his body is rapidly rejecting. Mm -hmm. Oh, the ink machine. Original ink machine. Before a major visual upgrade, this version of the ink machine was the one used in the game. Much of this machine's iconic fan love design was translated into the final version. Awesome. Yeah, this is what the ink machine used to look like. Just a thing in a small room. Oh, there's this whole middle part. Is this the head of... This is like Bertram's head or whatever? It's terrifying. These three. The Butcher Gang. The Piper, er, Striker, and Fisher make up the dreaded Butcher Gang. Interestingly, the ink corrupted versions of the characters were designed first, then were... Re Verse engineered back into their more family friendly cartoon forms. They have family friendly cartoon forms? Hmm. Very cool. Um, yeah, I guess I'll head to the main menu. That's awesome. Thank you all for watching. Oh wait, no. I will say, the worst part of this game is definitely that sneak mission I had to do forever. Even the parts that I died at most a lot, 
those are fine, because those were fun. This was just torture, <laughs> having to get through that. So, um, thank you all for watching. Bye-bye.